What's up, you guys? It's your boy Caglietti out here in Bakersfield, California. Um, here specifically on Chester doing a car show. I just posted up admiring all these classic cars and also modified cars. For those that uh, are into cars, uh, this video is out for you guys. Uh, whatever car you love or like, or throw it down on the comment section. And uh, yeah, let's stay to it. <sighs> just checking out some new cars here, a little car show in town. Uh, giving out ki uh, toys for the kids. You know, for a good cause, helping out the community always. You know, check out the nice motor. So today's a little bit different. There's some classic cars also with modified cars as well. So on this video, you're probably gonna check out a little bit modified. Newer cars, if you guys also wanna check those out. Looking nice, looking clean. Let me get some angle shots for you guys. You know what I'm saying? Shoo. This bad boy looks like a track car. Oh my gosh. Looking nice. Got that nice chrome inside there. Jeez. Look on the inside so you guys can check out the insides. How the inside looks. I want to stick my phone all the way inside the car, but you know what I'm saying? So you guys can look at that. Obviously, this is your boy's car right here. You know, 66 Impala, obviously. You know what I'm saying? 283 motor. Everything's fucking original. I guess besides lowering it, but catch my drift bro looking fucking nice always you know what i'm saying it's your boy's ride right here you know what i'm saying try to keep it kind of fucking clean they're not day tens but whatever bro they looking nice but inside my car always fucking clean it's mandatory it's mando my front grill always keep that shit clean too looking nice from the side love my baby Got here some troquitas. If you guys want to check out some troquitas, it's probably one of my favorite colors right here. If you guys want to know, orange is fucking balling, bro. I, I love this color. It's probably the fucking best color ever, bro. Look at the interior. Just looks fucking nice. Looks fucking extraordinary. Just so you guys can get the full on details and shit. If you if you guys are interested in also buying classic cars, I always fucking recommend it. I always tell everybody, you know what? Whatever your desire in life is, just fucking get it, bro. Cause life's too fucking short, and uh, yeah, you don't want to just fucking have a normal ass car. Sometimes you just want to have some badass clean shit. When you're driving, people are like, you know what? This motherfucking shit is cool. This shit right here looks nice as fuck. You know. Store some stuff inside. Uh, enough room space in there. You can put chairs, tables up in there. Looking nice, bro. Also an Impala. What's up, bro? Obviously looking fucking great. You already know I love fucking Impalas. She looks fucking nice on the inside, bro. Check this out. Oh, you can see he put a little screen. That's right. That's right. Got the screen in there. <laughs> Check out the motor. Not too sure what number of motor it is. Uh, could be a 350. Could be. I'm not too sure what this one is. But looking nice. Either way, he has a crispy clean, not all chromed out, just simple black mat. Looks nice, bro. Looks from the front. Check it out. And they got another classic Chevy. Man, I just love these Chevys out here. It's starting to get warm out here. Hell yeah. It's pretty fucking cold right now, but. 
I feel the sun coming on. Another just simple black motor, all blacked out. Actually, this one is probably one of the cleanest ones out here. Just simply fucking nice. We wanna check that out from a distance. Bam. She. She, 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 she. The mirrors. Got your nice rounded mirrors. Looking great, looking cool. Just bam. I like the back, it's Chevelle. You guys are trying to buy some Chevelles, some nice looking one. This one right here is a bit different. Um, now you're gonna start getting into like a little bit of modified cars and stuff and some, uh, I would say like some movie cars. I don't know what category to place it in, but uh, go ahead and put it in the comments what you guys think or what you want to call it. But check it out. You got the Ghostbuster car. I think that's where you store all the ghosts or bad vibes. I'm saying, who do you call? Obviously, we know Ghostbuster. We're, we're not a fan of ghosts out here. You know what I'm saying? So we call these guys up real quick. <laughs> Just fucking bullshit. But looking fucking cool, man. Something different, you know? Got his gadgets up there. You know, if you guys ever watch that movie, it's pretty fucking dope, you know? So here in my town, we actually catch our ghosts, you know what I'm saying? Here we got another little hot rod. Woo. Got those big tires for traction. Check those out. Looking fucking nice. Fresh paint job. Also got some flames going on. Hey, how's it going, man? Good, what year is your car? 69 Z28. All right. Did you uh, do all this yourself, or did you get somebody to help I you? I bought it just like that. Just like, just that. like that. I bought it. I don't know if you want to give us a price range of the number, or just saying it's a pretty penny. We respect it's, both. It's quite a bit of money. <laughs> yeah, it's quite a bit of money. Looking nice, brother. Thank you. Appreciate it. You guys want to check out the inside? Nice. So for people out there that don't know, cars like this, obviously whenever you ask that question, not due respect, I always ask how much it's worth and if someone gives you the answer, that's well. And if when they don't give you the answer, you gotta give that person the respect. Why? Because when it comes to just classic cars, it's just beautiful cars, bro. All right, now we're gonna go to the next category. We got a couple of sport cars. How's it going? Good morning. Hey, how are you? Uh, by any chance, you want to share any details of your car? I'm embarrassed. <laughs> what year is your car? It's a 21. A 2021. The lights aren't even on. Or <laughs> it's great. I mean, everybody's going to think your car is <laughs> rad. Um, vertical doors. I actually drove down to them in Lake Elsinore. Where they at? You got the Labradors. They did my last car, too. If you guys are interested in doing some Lambo doors, I, I believe they go great. Look at the interior, bro. So this is a little bit different, but check this out, man. If you guys are fanatics of racers, this is a nice racing car right here. Look at that. Look at the seats, bro. They even still got the tag, bro. Come on, bro. They ain't playing here. That's cars going gone. Not. I love these matte black rims. This shit looks fucking dope. It looks fucking crazy. I'm gonna try to see if you guys can get that, but it's like basically like a shoelace that she has up here. She has her, her cleaning materials, you know, try to keep that car clean. I like the back fin of it. Look at that shit. That shit just looks dope. And here's more of the design if you guys want to check it out. You know, it's pretty low. If you guys can check that, I'm not too sure if it has bags or not, but it's pretty lowered. It's actually touching the ground. We got the nice lip going on. Got the bars holding the lip. 
you got her also having her customized shoelace piece going all down the middle of the car i don't know if you guys can see but there's two sided colors of this car which makes it look like fabulous you know for those that are fanatics bam Now we're going back to the classics they kind of just mixed all the cars around today but check out this motor bro it's looking fucking clean like that air filter i'm saying breathable it's pretty nice so they came out here and just made sure it just looks fucking nice oh look i gotta show you guys where the bands are at everything just fucking chrome slash reddish it's looking fucking nice bro Now this car right here is just fucking awesome. I would get this car and probably take it to a track and just fucking race the shit out of it. Some nice rims. We got another one that's similar, but they both got their differences. Got a nice trunk space. I'm not too sure if they probably have some subwoofers in, in there somewhere, or that's probably just a trunk space. Um, super sport for those that want to know. Check out the car, the inside. Oh, okay, I see. Yep, right there, bro. Those that know, they know, bro. Let's get it. Yeah. The leather seats just look fucking crazy. The mirrors. Look at all the classic cars. It's the mirrors for me, bro. And that is the motor. Fuck, this one right here just... To me, they all look crazy. Because these guys take care of their cars. Some people either bought them like that. Or little by little throughout years of work. They establish their creations by themselves, man. Kind of like some type of Frankenstein, you know what I'm saying? You get parts of all kinds of sort. It just looks fucking nice. And let's let's do a little shout out right here for AFR. Don't know who those guys are. Airflow Research. But you know what I'm saying? We give, we give them some fame, you know what I'm saying? We give them something, you know? Looking certified. Super sport. Here we got a nice Hemi, bro. I know a lot of people love Hemis. I'm not too sure if they do waste a lot of gas, but I remember back then I was trying, your boy was trying to get one, and I was just like, "How, how is it on gas?" People would tell me it, it drinks gas. That's what everybody would tell me. Got a nice rims on there. I love the color. For those that don't know, my favorite colors are purple and fucking orange, bro. Why? Does it just look fucking like they pop out, you know? They stand out. Looking nice. You know, got a nice paint job to it. How's it going, you guys? Here's another one for you guys to check out. Is this a Cobra? Shelby. Shelby? Looking nice. What year is it? 2008. 2008. Did you buy it like this or did you uh, put bought stuff it. to it? I bought it. You had to put 2,500 miles on it before Shelby will work on it. Okay. You just blow the motor or nothing. Yeah. You can take it back to Shelby and every, how much you want to spend, they'll do it. Oh, okay. So you paid people to uh, modify your car throughout the years, or did you put your hands in there? One time, I put the brakes on it, and the wheels on it, the wheels they, uh, and the brakes, blower on it. Oh, okay. And uh, I wanted Shelby to do it that way. It's a certified Shelby blower car. You don't see this too often. And then all those test drivers from the '60s signed my signature signed. All the test drivers from the '60s that are alive signed uh, that. This thing car is straight up modified by professionals. Nice. There you go. 
check out the inside. And then I kind of already checked these out, but just so you guys can get them too. And then we got that classic over there, bro. Oh. What do you get? Get out of the thing. Oh. What's that thing? We didn't get a Salty. We have the Lowrider. We have a black Chevy, number 33. That's how we do it, baby. First place, bro. Yeah. I'm out. Ha! Ah.